we're so sorry. We did not want to make this video. But it had to be done. Um. Where do we even begin? It all started back. And I think it was Sonic Gens, wasn't it? Sonic Gens episode one. Where Donkey Kong at the final at the final moments of the episode decided to sexually assault Salt. mic our microphone. And we accidentally let this slip by like like four or five times. <laughs> I which think it is might have been a couple more than that. But Mike decided he wanted to forgive him uh, however many times, right? And then, you know, GTA 5 Episode 2 was the breaking point. Yeah. It was... We, we gave Donkey Kong a choice. It was either stop or he goes to a concentration camp for horny people. For horny monkeys. And... And we... We, we th sent him. We thought, we, we thought he was... He th we thought he was changing. Yeah, we thought he was getting better. We like, legitimately he, even, did. Even Mike almost forgave him. And then, in the final moments of that episode, I don't even want to say it. It happened again. That's he, all we'll go into. Yeah, he did it again. So, after so much arguing. And so much fighting. And just so, so much, much pain. So much pain. Crackhead Hbox has a fucking black eye from it. He got fucking punched in the face by Donkey Kong because he was getting mad. Yeah. Poor guy. He's not going to be able to play Melee properly for a good month. weeks. Yeah, I don't know. I don't remember how long that guy was last. Neither year. do I. That's besides the point. By the way, Donkey Kong will be most likely gone until like year three, honestly. He'll be gone for a while. At mm -hmm. camp, at like, at the point he got to deceiving us. We're gonna have to keep him there for a while. Yeah. Longer, longer than expected. I don't think he's as dumb as we previously thought. It's just so disappointing how to end this way. But rest assured, he'll be back soon. Someday. Um, but at least he's finally getting the help he needs. Yeah, and he'll hopefully be over it when we next see him. Yeah, so. We will That's test him, though. Maybe. Before. When he gets back. I don't know if we'll put him in a video right away. Will we? I don't know. But Once he gets home, we'll let him adjust for like a week or two. I, I can't believe this is something that we have to talk about. I know. Like. this the, It shouldn't have been a problem. Honestly, this shouldn't have never happened like I don't know why what like I don't know what possessed him to do such a thing I just I don't get it, guys I, I really don't yeah I don't understand Poor Mike like I don't understand why I thought this was a good idea I don't know if he like legitimately was just horny so horny that he wanted to fucking have sex with Mike he might or just... he thought it would have been funny for the video or what but like next time we're just gonna teach him how to jerk off which is gonna be a I very would... uncomfortable conversation but... but it's it's better than this it's better than this at least he can take it out some way anyways this is it for us guys um Goodbye, Donkey we're ta Kong. We're taking... We're gonna take a leave of absence from YouTube, I think. After yeah. this. Um, because this is just such a horrific event. So, don't expect a lot of videos. For in, a little bit. Yeah, we need to recover as a... Um... Just as a business, friends. We're like a group of friends. We so we still haven't told Avid about this whole thing. Like, we're so... We're so, like... I don't know. Hbox lives with us. All the basement Mike buds lives with us. All the basement Donkey buds Kong crew do us. live with us. Yeah, like, like we're basically family. Exactly, and to have him just do that to us like that—that's just that's not cool. That's not. That we can't tolerate that. We, and we won't tolerate that, which is why we sent him away. If it continues, 
afterwards. We'll definitely have to think about permanently taking him off the channel. Unfortunately, yes. Which, I don't want to do that. But... That would really suck. If worse comes to worse... It's, it, it's that or sexual harassment. And we always... We would always choose taking him off the channel permanently. Indeed. Because that's not something that can be tolerated. Indeed. It's just... It's just frustrating, guys. Like... It's not okay. Remember when we thought Crackhead Hbox was the most problematic person on this channel? Yeah. It's just... I don't know. You don't see people for who they really are sometimes. And I think that's just the lesson here. Yeah. Honestly. There's... So, yeah. A lot to be learned from this situation. There's a lot. We need to really think about this. So... I'll see you guys in the next episode.